Have you noticed how hard it is to make an offer today? Let's talk about that. Hi, I'm Charlotte Mabry with Keller Williams Realty, and today we're going to talk about five things that you as a home buyer need to know before you make an offer. Speaking of things to know, look around our blog here. You'll see some buttons you can click on to find out more about buying a home. Or if you're thinking of selling, we've got a lot of great information there as well. So if you're thinking about buying a home and you're getting ready to make an offer, how do you stand out in this crazy market that we have? Number one on my list would be know what you can afford. Let's don't be out there making offers on homes maybe that are at the tippy top of what you can afford to do. You might back down a little bit and be looking at homes that might be a little less expensive so that if you do find the perfect thing, you can afford to stretch on up there and not go beyond what you can afford. So knowing your numbers, that is so, so important. Second thing on my list is know that the pace, it's gonna be fast. If your agent calls you and said, hey, you need to come look at this house, trust me, you'd better go look at that house. It will be gone like that. So you gotta be prepared to move quickly and perhaps be flexible with your work schedule and your timing so that you can get off to take a look at these properties. Now, when you do make your offer, you need to make a strong offer. It needs to be fair, fair for you, fair for the seller, but you'll need to make most likely your best offer first used to be back in the good old days that we would make an offer and see what the seller did. Well, that's not the case today. That's not our market. So you'll need to make your strongest and most likely your best offer up front. So don't be thrown when your agent asks you for that. And you'll need to be a flexible negotiator. If they come back and say, hey, we need different time to stay in the property, or maybe we need to, the sellers want to rent afterwards, you might have to be a little flexible on closing date in those things. So keep that in mind. Many times that's a way to get a house if you're flexible on terms uh, and you don't have to necessarily spend more money. Number five on the list and probably most important is you need to be able to lean on a seasoned real estate professional. There are a lot of great agents in our market here, but you need to be working with someone who really understands multiple offers and understands the process and the tips and the tricks on how to help you win your offer when you are involved in many offers being presented at the same time. We on the Charlotte Mabry team, we have some awesome people who really know what they're doing. I'd love to hook you up with one of them. If you'll just send me an email, charlotte at charlottemabryteam.com, I can hook you up. We can help you win that house. So happy house hunting. Thanks for watching our blog. We'll see you next time.